Welcome to uh, the Beard Me That Beer podcast show. I'm David. I'm Sam. And welcome to Pod Deck Mini number eight. What the heck? It should be fuck. We both agree it should be fuck, fuck because on this podcast we say fuck. So yeah, we're using the from the Pod Deck uh, series. What the heck? And Sam said he looked at one of his cards, so he now must go give me a thousand push-ups. Or that would be good for my health. Or Thank chug you. three beers. Mm, one is much healthier for me, <laughs> but one might be easier. One. No, thank you. <laughs> All right. So, and I have not looked at my cards because I am a good person. So I'm not a bad person. Let's just do the card. I'm you a looked. good person, David. The card you looked at. What okay. Is it? Are you ready? Yes. What the heck? We don't know what, what, what these. I don't remember what these are. But uh, all right, here we go. Number one, if you could bring back one famous person back. Let me start over. <laughs> if I just, you could my bring eyes back scanned ahead. One famous person <laughs> back. <laughs> one famous person's back. No, um, if you could bring one famous person back uh, from the dead, who would you pick? <sighs> That's an interesting question because I, I could not care less. Um, Heath Ledger. Heath Ledger? Yeah, I'll go that one. Now, uh, okay. Does it say why? No. Cool. Or it doesn't say why or like, uh, you know, like a length of time. Like it's like bring him back for a day. No. Which is bring him back the is. Uh, indefinitely. But I brought, yeah, bring Heath Ledger back. Okay. Gone too soon. That's for sure. Mm-hmm. Um, Would you put him to work? Hmm? Would you put him to work? Of course. Hey, uh, act more. Batman. Uh, I mean, he was supposed to be in the Dark Knight Rises. Mm-hmm. A little, little cameo. Um, and I think his career would have like been top tier. Just kept going. After that movie, yeah. Just kept on an upward. 10 things I hate about you. Number two would have definitely been in the works. 11 things. 20 things I hate about uh, you. Ah, it's a lot. At that point, why would you be friends yeah. or know somebody? <laughs> should just give up. But there's only 10 million things I love about you. Oh, that's great. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Um, Gone too soon. Very good actor. All right, that's a that's a that's a good pick, I suppose. Ooh, I don't know, man. Famous person, go. Who would I pick? You now, should I pick like a creative type or like you like do. a real life like someone I know? Or it like, says famous person. Sam. Did it? What if I know someone famous or that, knew someone famous? Who do you know that's famous that died? I mean, like myself. No, <laughs> in the future, no. Um, don't roll your eyes at me. <laughs> that was stupid. What though. if you didn't know? How, what if you didn't know yourself? What if you were dead? What if you weren't uh, famous? What's a weird sleeper hit? Mister Rogers. Mister Rogers. Mister Rogers. He's dead. To the neighborhood. Bring him back to the neighborhood, and put more cheerful stuff on television again. It was very genuine. It was very and nice. nice, wholesome, and told endearing, you not, and not. To be an asshole. Yeah, he's just like just a just a nice guy. <laughs> we need. It would be nice to have you a know, nice thing that back because that that's sorely missed in the world we live in today. I would say just a cool, just a cool, nice guy. Was he on PBS? Yeah, I think maybe. I don't know. It was one of those. Are there P? Is PBS just a California thing? Public broadcasting station Was... system station. Site, <laughs> I don't know. Service. What? Yes, probably. I don't know. But yeah, yeah, Mr. Rogers. Okay, because he's a nice fellow. Because he's a cool guy. All right, my question: <clears throat> Can you do any tricks with your tongue? Uh, I can come do... over here, Sam. Oh, oh I'll show you my tricks. <laughs> you I my can do tricks. the taco roll, and I can do the clover. All right, do it. Okay, so all right. I mean, I can't really do it. I, I'm, I'm gonna, my I'm gonna say this. I knew that would happen, Sam. That's not the. No. I can do it. I've done it. I can do it. Sam's mouth is. I like, have to. It's literally ninety percent closed. <laughs> no, you gotta no. stick it out. It and has do the to, I have. To, I can't really do it unless I'm looking at a mirror. It's a weird. I like. I have to Get see it out. and shave Come it. On. Get right, your phone on. out. No, because let me do, let me do this and I open do. your mouth. Gonna, okay, <laughs> don't op- have it fucking open closed. the mouth. Also, the roll taco. How fucking that's everyone in the world, Sam. Here, 
Look, I did it. You see Sam, picture? that is not the you clover. You see the picture. That is, the picture. That is not a clover. I did it. Oh, I didn't, I didn't even know these were. I, that was a trick. I thought that's just what normal people can do. I mean, I can French kiss. I can French kiss too. Show me. I can. Look, <laughs> I can lick a lot that's of holes great. too. That's great. That's a dumb question. What? <laughs> I it's got a it too. <laughs> Stupid. Um, can you do the cherry stem thing? What like tie like, it? No. I I I'm think not, I've done I'm it not once. Freaking MacGyver with my tongue. I think I've done it once. Fucking does a clover, kind of. Kind of. It was you, a got, you have a part of it. I'll give you that. A four but it's leaf not a clover. fucking full clover with your fat tongue. All right, go ahead. <laughs> You're a dick. All right, yeah, here we go. Tongue. People you know appreciate what? that. PH. Women, women appreciate that. They don't need to put that out there. Same All right, big. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> what Guinness World Record do you think you could break in the future? Well, for one, I haven't looked at a Guinness record book in a long time. Also, they don't all make it onto the book. What so if you just a make a new record? Most times. I think of something Don't outlandish. they have to like be like, no, that's just not something we'd be interested in? Yeah, so you would have to find, find something, something that they're like, yeah, okay. Pretty extraordinary. I mean, like, I don't... I'm not outright extraordinary. Is there, is there a... a a uh, Guinness Book of World Records record for a, how much mayonnaise eaten in a certain time. I think I can do that. Why would you do that? To mayonnaise yourself? does not bother me. The taste of it does not bother me at all. I feel like after a certain amount, like you're just gonna the be the texture sick. might might get, be a little bit, but I'm pretty sure I can eat mayonnaise full blown. Just well, no, I mean like I I don't think that would be an issue, but I think after a certain point, it'd be like doing a gallon challenge. Just like your body just cannot process that, that amount dairy. of mayo. Dairy. I don't. I wouldn't want that in my body. That's. I mean, there's a lot of things you shouldn't want in your body, Sam. But you keep, you know, at it. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you, doctor. Uh, I think I can. What would you say, doctor? <laughs> Thank you, doctor. <laughs> doctor. Uh, <laughs> doctor. Fuck. Head. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> nice haircut. <laughs> yeah. Nice haircut. Who did it? The, the, the barber. <laughs> the barber store. The barber. The barber man. <laughs> Um, I, I think I could do something like that. So mayo? I, I think most I could. mayo. I think I could. Oh, so what it, would the record be? Is this most mayo consumed? Most mayonnaise consumed in, in one sitting in a minute or five minutes. Some sort in of a minute. Oh, you're putting a time limit. Yeah. In in fourteen years. <laughs> I would. Have How would that you track right that? Yeah, I have that now. <laughs> um. Well, fuck. I don't. I don't know what I, I couldn't could do. do anything beer related now just because I just I think I lost it's it. Just a can't. It's just also a... the like the pint thing is like point one second. I just I can't do that. Um, well, something you could break in the future. Why something weird? Um, most times visited an Applebee's, probably. Yeah, but I'm so casual. If I took, if I step my game up, maybe that's what I'm saying. For the future, I think um, you could. I would say mm, <laughs> most two for twenties eaten by themselves. <laughs> uh, no, no, I want, I want, I want to. No, I couldn't do that. I was gonna say visit every Applebee's on the globe. That's the too, most yeah. times. <laughs> so like four times every Applebee's. Jesus. But no, I don't like to travel. So Yeah. I mean, I would. Yeah, that's four days each place. Yeah. Well, four days each place. You can't go to the same Applebee's four times in one day. No. That's not allowed. No, I would do I would do all of them once. And then like again. laps. Oh, and then again. again. Oh, okay. And then again. Okay. And then again and just waste so much money. I'm gonna say this. That's stupid. It is stupid. <laughs> but that's what that's, the Guinness records the are. The Guinness people would be like, please go away. Uh <laughs> please, see. please stop calling us. Uh What's something I could do? Uh, you know what? I would say most shirts worn at one time. Because I would just put layer, 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 the, the layer, Joey layer. If I trick. could train for it, layer, 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 layer. So would the record be how many you could put on in the quickest time? I would say I would say like the, most shirts, in, the most in shirts. The most shirts. Yeah, yeah. Okay. That's a, that's an interesting record. That's a that's a stupid record. Yeah. Also, I would probably shed so much water weight in those two minutes, and what whatever receding minutes and trying to take them you off. You couldn't have any help. 
No, no. How about how about this? We do most shirts put on in two minutes, and then you have to stay in them for, for like an hour. You die. All right. Next question, Sam. <laughs> it's 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 yours, isn't it? I just did one, didn't I? Oh, is it my turn? Did you do so. your second one? Yeah, that was my second okay. number two. Um, have you ever had a this can't be happening moment? What was it? Every time i wake up (laughs) this can't be happening i want to be sleeping again no um uh (laughs) my famous mace moment would be pretty good my pepper spray i'm like i can't believe what is this (laughs) what is this uh and for me it'd be when i shattered my kneecap yeah Okay. Things, things would be very different. If you want those stories, go back to our some, injury podcast some, yeah, some episode, podcast injury. and we will explain in detail. Yeah, but graphic. That, but both detail. of those make a lot of sense, yeah. I say. My life would be very different. Yeah. You could be... David would be I'd out be running marathons. I'd be on a marathons. football team right now. Yeah. <laughs> a professional. I'd be a, I would not be friends with... <laughs> yeah, probably. Yeah. He's like, he's beneath me. My health... <laughs> he would be... It would be like Entourage. He would be have... one of those guys with me. <laughs> David would have such entourage. immaculate health. He's like, I can't be... I can't be I can bothered be to have... with yeah. you. <laughs> <laughs> you bring me down. Or I, I would boost be, you up. I would, I would have gone for like a, a beer mile world record. And succeeded. And succeeded. Yeah. You know, I have you could, a, and, I was going to say, because you could go for it now. And cans, not bottles. Yeah. Pussies. <laughs> All right. You're it's nice. I like how uplifting you are for everybody. It's just, <laughs> you're such a good yes, guy. Yes, you're good. You're good. All right. Life next. This <laughs> 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 is fucking stupid. If your office had show and tell for adults, what thing would you be proud to display? Okay, so I have to bring it though. Yeah. God, that's that's the pain. <laughs> well, for one, fuck that. I'm like, I don't <laughs> care to know any people. Uh, I w- I would try to bring something just like just stupid and and incredibly inappropriate. That's a good idea. That's what I would buy. Um, from Parks and Rec. Uh-huh. Uh huh. The Sweetums factory owner, uh-huh. the naked picture of him in a wheelchair Uh uh-huh i would buy that and bring it interesting i i just or the kramer something like that i would just bring something so stupid and just to show how stupid having show and tell so work (laughs) that's good that's a good idea i would i would i would pick something that would alienate me from everybody so they wouldn't have to talk to me like Hitler's foreskin or something. No, uh, I would bring a your foreskin. Like yeah, exactly. no, uh, like gold member. I would bring like the the little uh, the thing with the the scabs or whatever. <laughs> Just the skin. <laughs> these are my his, these are my keepers. His little box of <laughs> his little skin box of skin flakes. And then I just pull him out, and they're like, "Fuck, don't talk to him, <laughs> fucking weirdo." Sam, like, you should tell. wear gloves all the time and a face mask. <laughs> <laughs> but that would be what I would bring. Oh my that god, that would be that would be. That they're like, "Are you good. fucking serious?" Holy shit. <laughs> Please uh, save me from myself. <laughs> all right, that's good. All right, next for me, would you ever pick up a hitchhiker? No. Pick up a hitchhiker? No, absolutely not. I mean, like, if you don't know already, every hitchhiker is a it is pretty is sketchy a serial killer. I mean, like, I wouldn't mind like like giving a giving a buck or something, but I don't want anyone in my car. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. Maybe it was like somebody I met while I was out, but not like just any person off the street. That's uh, even that. That is crazy. Yeah, you're asking to be killed. Yeah, that's cool. All right, next question for you. All right, here we go. Ah, that was anticlimactic and short. Your question. All right, if you, (laughs) what? (laughs) If you could marry a fictional character, who would it be? Um, fictional, fictitional, fictitious, fictitious. (sighs) Who would it be? Damn, this is super hard. This is hard. Yeah. Like my penis right now, or this person I want. <laughs> At how excited I am over yeah. this, this silly question. Damn, I'm gonna go Hermione Granger. Uh, when she's older, obviously. Okay. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> do you just like think she's? Old? I mean, like. F- 12 all aside the time. from the bit at the end of where it's the like the epilogue at the end too. when she's already an married adult hermione granger okay 
just pre-married to Ron. Nah, they got a divorce. You know oh, they're they divorced. Di- oh. You know they totally divorced. Okay, so she's much older. Yeah. Like, okay. Interesting. Well, they got remarried pretty young. Yeah, but like, you know that epilogue, like dropping off kids yeah. with, with Albus Severus I know, that's such the worst fucking shit. name in the world, dumbass <laughs> Harry Potter. Um, uh, yeah, Hermione Granger. Okay. Who would I... I don't know. Uh, let me think. Hmm. We should come up with a list of a the, list? Our, our top five fictitious. Nobody women wants to we hear would this. Want to marry? No or, or characters. Uh, That's a good one. I think. That's a good. Uh, good just episode. fantasy pairing. Fantasy sex night. <laughs> <laughs> who would who would who would make who would be a cool person? I don't fucking know. Um. Um. Anyone from Resident Evil? For, <laughs> why's it gotta be that? Devil May Cry. I don't know. Fuck no, not from. Uh, it's like anyone from the Devil May Cry universe Ooh, is a Pam monster. Would have been a good one, I think. What? Or a uh, Karen from The Office. Oh, she's hot. As fucking uh, Rashida Jones is. I'm trying to think of somebody relatable to you that I find to relatable. The world. <laughs> so I don't. I don't know. <laughs> I would pick someone I could be friends with. Mm. I don't know, man. I am like drawing a severe blank right now. All right, what did I watch recently? Mm. Wanda from WandaVision. Uh, no, because you know she bad. she just. Kidnap that entire town. Just and she, she was. That's, that's she too was much. Having that's a too. Moment. That's too much. It's too much. She was for, having a moment. As per my. Yeah, I, I mean, yeah, sure. Pick someone you want to pick. Don't pick someone because I. Said I know. That. I'm like. I'm like. Well, it's definitely not that. Who? Meg from Family Guy. <laughs> <laughs> Who let you back in the house? <laughs> um. Shut up, Meg. Fucking what? It's okay. We have time. Uh, uh, no, I don't want to pick that person. I almost <laughs> said Amy from Brooklyn Nine Nine, but I'm like, no, she's crazy. She, she would annoy the fuck out of you. Yeah, and you are not able to handle Rosa too. No, they are far too out. They're they're too you. they're too they're both too far on the extremes. I think. I mean, and like, not near I just need your someone. Extreme. I need someone that's kind of lazy. Who, but not as lazy as you. Maybe just a little less lazy, but someone in Who's that. Who's the girl from Shameless? I don't. I don't watch that. She's pretty hot too. I don't know. I don't know. She, she hmm. seems too aggressive for you, though. Too aggressive. <laughs> this is like fictional dating fictional. game show. I don't Behind know. door number one, Sam. We wow. have. <laughs> I had, I did not think I would be stuck on this dumb question. Uh, what? Just go by who you think is an attractive fictional character then. That's weird. It's fine. It's a question. No one's going to think you're weird unless uh, you say something weird. I mean, you like, taking I might, this long is weird. It is weird. I'm like, because I don't, I don't know. This isn't something I think about. Uh, just a lot of stammering. A lot of just twiddling my fingers. I'm thinking really hard. Um, that doesn't help, David. That really, really doesn't help. You know what? I would pick... Hmm. What? Yeah. What is something recently you just saw? What did you I watch last I'm, night? I'm trying to th- just last night. Yeah. What did I watch last night? <laughs> I don't even remember. I w- I definitely watched some of Constantine. I didn't finish it. Rachel Weiss's character in it. Isn't it Weiss? Is it Weiss or Weiss? Well, I don't want. I wouldn't pick her because you know hell's after her. I can't handle her. that. Well, not. I mean, I fit. I didn't finish the movie. <laughs> Have you ever seen that movie? Yeah, I've seen it. Then you, then you know what? No, I'm going true off of what I watched. <laughs> I was at the part. It's, it's like I've never seen it. Uh, yeah, exactly. <laughs> uh, fuck. Starlight from the boys. Queen Maeve. No, both. You know, you know who would be Phoebe Buffay from Friends? You, you and her. Phoebe. Yeah. Both musicians. She's lazy. And she's weird. She's eccentric. Okay. Boom. Sure. And taller than you. And taller than me. 
I can see Sam with a taller woman. <laughs> woman. I'm gonna tell. And she's a woman. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, sure. <laughs> I'll go with that. I just went off my Funko. Trailer. I know. I'm like, that's what I should have did. I'm like, she's like, I'm visual. She's like, what's the only, uh, what's here? I have Jan Levison up there. I would pick Jan. Meredith Palmer. No, thank you. <laughs> Starlight, Queen Maeve. Matt. Yeah, they could both destroy me. I don't want to. I don't. I wouldn't okay want to be that. partnered with someone that could melt me with their eyeballs. Yeah, if you make them a, like, oh, I didn't mean it. I you messed up. Great. Okay, but yeah, yeah. Or Elaine Bennis from Seinfeld. I mean, I already she's said the awesome. one thing. She's awesome too. As I mean, Sophie. no, she's a terrible character, oh but the, her her actor, Julia. All right, we can move on. Okay, what is the grossest thing you've ever seen someone do in public? Uh, in public? Yeah. <clears throat> like it. it totally uh, just uh, on that. We have a friend that does this. I won't say his name because uh, it'll embarrass him. Will I know? Cutting your nails. I think that's super gross to do in public. This is somebody we know? I know. I was like, I don't think you I probably know anybody. Do. You know, you know. I just don't want to. You don't uh, want cutting to your them. nails. Fingernails. Cutting nails. Your nails. In public. Because then you, you just, they just drop on the ground. Well, what if they, like, collect them? That's they, like, worse. Like, put them in their this, hand and they is... throw them away when they can? Mm-hmm. Or Have you have you tried? Have, have you ever cut your fingernails? Do they just fall? I mean, David, <laughs> I don't have six foot long fingernails on the ends of my cuticles i have standard they don't grow is what you're saying no i cut them how they're hard like they just fall everywhere what they just snap everywhere how are you cutting they your don't fingernails? just like oh nicely just stacked they don't stack themselves sam what do you like cut them what when they're like about? a centimeter you're, you're do you bite your nails too uh shut up david not really <laughs> not anymore <laughs> Not today. Uh, I'm trying to think. <laughs> yeah, I think that's gross to do. So cut your nails. Cutting in your public. fingernails in public. That, uh, I've seen it, and I think it's gross. Save it for the home. Uh, well, it's not. It's not. I would say this is the thing I see that grosses me out. But like, it's kind of common. But like people that like sneeze into their hands, and then like. Wipe don't the, wash them right away yeah and like the yeah they don't wash them right away they're just like in. just like smeared on their pants or something or and then and then like and like i won't see them go to a restroom but then like they'll meet somebody and go for a handshake it's like that like, blue streak kind of moment where he puts all that fucking gel on his junk and then goes to shake the guy's hand yeah that fucking hilarious. exactly but yeah that's pretty gross before covid too mm-hmm. like you should be if you're not running to the bathroom Or just at least have like hands. Do you have two more or one more? I think I have one more. Okay, like, I, I dropped. Say, you, I dropped I cards. I was like, did yeah. I drop the one card I needed? No, you did not. Okay. So sneezing into hand and not running to the bathroom. To it's not. The, but what was the question again? It's a. Uh, What's the grossest thing you've ever seen someone do? That's not the grossest thing I've ever seen. That's just something that grosses well, me just, out. What's the grossest thing? Probably just like someone shit on the street. It's probably. You've seen that? Like in L.A. You like I was that. driving. Okay, so we like. Did you? I was stop? with my girl. No, I was at like I was at a stoplight, and then I was turning, and then out of the corner of my eye, I see this dude just Squatting. like hunkered down on the on just on the side of the street. Uh huh. The sidewalk or in the street? Like in the street, like just off the sidewalk, uh-huh. like in the street. And okay. I was like, huh. That height level just it was just it was just real uncomfortable. Like, and it wasn't even like if you were to picture like in your mind's eye the posture someone has this when they're guy doing was that doing it all wrong he was just like like you think he's like squatting but like but it wasn't really squatting he was like about shit in his pants like he was like he just kind of standing so he was standing he's like standing <laughs> and he, he bent but like and his he had some bend in his knees but it was not nearly enough bend it was just like like it's gonna it's gonna touch like your, it's like his body part it's like so if you pulled your pants well, down, it, like pants it would fall into down? his pants were, yeah were his pants all the way to yeah. to his ankles yeah so he was butt naked, like he had he had clothes on, but he yeah, had like sure, but brought him down and. Were I mean, butt this naked. is not pleasant to talk about, no, but like awesome I see it out of the corner of my eye and I was like, mm, don't! I wish I could unsee that. That's that's Did there now. Did you see it coming out? Like. Did you see a little prairie dog? <laughs> no, 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 no. Thankfully, he was that end wasn't facing me, but there was like there was already stuff on the ground. So I'm like, he was yes. like in between, in the midst of. 
I don't even cutting one off. I'm like, for yeah, you. <laughs> so fucking gross. That's probably the gr- the worst thing I've seen. You know, he probably had too much fiber. He I, you go. know what? That's fine. <laughs> I Do don't. I else. don't want to. <laughs> I go in the alley. Behind There's more than enough alley. Just <laughs> not not for everyone yeah. to see. That's not that's not right. That's hilarious. That's a good way. It's terrible. Uh, all right, your last one. Sam. My last one. Hmm. What would be the absolute worst name you could give your child? And to have my last name. What? Sam, Sam has. I have options, but I'm not gonna say all that. Sam has a lot of options. <laughs> A lot of people don't know his last name. I won't say it, but he can really ruin his kid's life. I mean, I've kind of given some thought. <laughs> you should do it to the second kid. To the second kid? Uh, I don't know. And it says to... Uh, what, what? I'll read it again. What would be the, the worst, absolute worst, worst name you could give your child? See, unfortunately, I have such a cool last name. That it kind of wouldn't. I would have to pick something. You would just have to pick like, a really lame like standalone bag, name, like crap bag, like shithead, or Espiritu is still cool. Yeah, that's actually, you know, you need to pick a name so bad it brings the cool factor of your last yeah, name. Yeah, and that's impossible. Like, what's an awful word? I have no idea. Sam, what about you? Uh, if it was a boy, nickname Hugh. Nickname or middle name? Nickname Hugh. Full first name, Hugh Mungus. <laughs> <laughs> or um, if it was a girl, Anita. <laughs> I really like that one. I think <clears throat> you can do better. I can, but I'm like, we those are just the ones that I like throw out all the time. And I'm like, um, they kind of make me laugh. God. Humongous. <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> if you guys knew his last name, I'm I'm fighting back some loud laughs. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the Anita one's pretty good too. But um, I think he can go hard. I could probably be a little much, more hard. I could be much ruder. Fine. Yeah, yeah. You definitely can't be, and I'm surprised by your holding back. Um, <sighs> but yeah, like I would. Uh, if I just wanted to be demeaning, I would just name him like a noun or something, mm-hmm. like a boy or a girl. I am thinking of naming him something stupid and hip. Oh, name him something that wouldn't age well. Eight track. Racist. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, that's not Actually, a Actually, that's kind of cool, though. That's, a, that's not a name. That's the thing. That's just a word. If you give it to them, it's like calling it is your a name. kid Apple. You're. It is what, a dumb name. What's the. You're I mean, I guess it's, it's just, it's just a. The worst possible. It's not I, the I, worst. It's, it's just hard. a dumb it's, name. It's hard. worst and dumb are not the same. Yeah, I don't have a worse. Hmm. Like a a good name. Scrotum. That's not really a name, and it wouldn't be that bad. I mean, that's like saying I can just name him dumb fuck shit Trump balls Pornhub dot com. I like, mean, you that's could. Okay. That's the worst. Is that no, Elon there's... Musk? <laughs> Actually, you can't, couldn't name his kid that because in California you can't have any symbols in your name. Mm. Uh, idiot. <clears throat> um, That's why a bunch of your rockets keep blowing up. <laughs> okay. Um, any ideas though? Cuddlingus. That's just a word. <laughs> Cut. What did you say? <laughs> Cuddle. I I want to call him cum. <laughs> <laughs> You should name him. You should name him with a K. Come, come, and then middle name came. Come came. I'll name my kid come. I'm never gonna have a kid. That's so bad. <laughs> there is that's that? stupid. It's a. It's it is. I mean, like it's another word one, but it's like that would be a pretty awful. I wouldn't name. say C U M. It'd be K U M. Come, and two little dots over the U. <laughs> Fancy. All right, last one, uh, and we have thirty seconds. But this is short. Oh my God. Do you have a birthmark? If so, where? I do. On, on my foot. Face. Like, I think it's right here. Oh, yeah. I do not. You don't? Nope. Now you're staring at my feet. It just looks like a shadow from here. I really it does. Don't. I don't, I'm trying to see where it is. but I don't put makeup dark. on my feet, David. Not I swear. Yet. Not yet. I've got, I've got here, just turn plain it, oh, Turn feet. it towards you a little bit. I see it. Yeah, there yeah. it is. Yeah. It's just hard to see when it's yeah. down because it's really dark. I mean, like, I can We're can't... literally in the dark. Yeah. Like... 
Right. I think that's the only one I've got. So a mole, not a birthmark? Moles don't count. Okay. Because I'm like, I've got one on my face. Yep. Scars don't count. Because you, you chose those. You they didn't birth. You what? Didn't, you didn't get a scar birth. It's, yeah. Mean, that might be a thing, though. Hmm. All right, cool. I don't have any, but yeah. Cool. Yeah, fun stuff. Thanks so uh, for listening. <laughs> keep drinking, keep listening. Beer Me That Beer is a San Diego-based craft beer YouTube, Instagram, Twitch, and podcast show. And for more of us, check out BeardMeThatBeer.com. That's BeardMeThatBeer.com. If you want to reach out directly to us, email us at bmtbinfo at gmail.com. That's bmtbinfo at gmail.com.